Well, we get started with the bullying allegations against Katie ISD superintendent. Lance Hint says he wants to meet with the man who accused him of tormenting him decades ago when they were schoolmates. Jessica Borg is live in Katie with reaction now from the accuser. Jessica, what is he saying? The superintendent spokesperson told me he's interested in speaking one on one with his accuser to have an open dialogue and learn more details about, quote, the timeline of the assault. It's not exactly what Greg Gay tells me he wanted to hear, but he does believe it's a step in the right direction. I, I'll, I'll never forget. You know, it's something that. It's traumatic. 53 year old Greg Gay says he can still recall the details of an assault that happened back in seventh grade at West Memorial Junior High here in Katy. He says he had been bullied there relentlessly with kids making fun of his name. I went to the bathroom and when I turned around, some boys confronted me and they started beating me up. They grabbed me, shoved my head in the urinal. At a school board meeting in March, Gay stunned the crowd when he confronted former schoolmate and current Katy School Superintendent Lance Hint about that assault, claiming Hint took part in it. Lance, you were the one that shoved my head in the urinal. Since then, Gay says he's received about 700 messages from around the world, people writing words of support on social media, hoping to put an end to bullying. Says, I saw your story and want to say thank you for standing up to this man. Weeks have passed, but now Superintendent Hint says he wants to speak with Gay about the attack. He's not admitting anything, but not flat out denying his role in it either. Gay feels Dr. Hint should have reached out to him sooner, saying it would have proved he's serious about changing the culture of bullying in schools. Even if he'd have said, I don't remember doing this, but I'm sorry that it happened to you, let's work together and try to change some policy to make this better for other kids. Because that, that's the only reason I came forward. I'm scared to death that we're going to have another parkland here in Katy. Now, Gay makes it clear that he believes Dr. Hint is the right man for the job and that he does not want, wish for him to lose his job. I'm told Dr. Hint will not be publicly disclosing when he will be reaching out to Mr. Gay and that that conversation will be taking place in a private forum. We are live this evening in Katy, Jessica Borg, KHOU 11 News. Len Reka. Well, it sounds like both sides are at least willing to come to the table now, so that is good. Thank you, Jessica. Yeah, it's a story that just keeps on growing. Thank mm -hmm. you.